Vidya. Good morning to one and all present here. As we all know, we have gathered here to celebrate Children's Day. 14th November is very special for every child. It is the celebration of innocence. It is the birth anniversary of the first Prime Minister of India, Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. He was a prominent leader of the Indian independence movement. He served as Prime Minister of India twice. He shared a lovely bond with children and was very affectionate towards them. Children loved and fondly called him Chacha Nehru. Children's Day means our day. So we have come up with many wonderful programs to entertain you all. So let us start this event with prayer. I would like to call Arya Arun for the prayer. Hello. you. Nanmaya gunna kandhi kanuvan kandhi nake name. Nalla vakkinde shilu challuvan navi nake name. of all gather here, I heartily welcome our student Prime Minister, Mr. Devanarayan from 7C. I request you to come and enlighten the audience with your precious words as we begin with the event. Hello, your respected teachers, principal, vice principal and my dear friends. I am Devanarayan. I am representing as your school Prime Minister. So you all know today's importance is Children's Day. It's celebrated across the India to increase awareness of rights, care and education to children. It's celebrated on number 14 every year to tribute for first Prime Minister Jamalal Nehru. So even though at this pandemic situation, our government has came up with something new, NEP. So let's talk about NEP. So NEP, the National Education Policy, was introduced by our government at July 2020 which aims to change in our educational system for the 21st century. So the way we followed was 10 plus 2, now which is 1st standard to 10th standard plus 11th and 12th. But we are now entirely changing. We are changing to 5 plus 3 plus 3 plus 4. That means the first 5 years which is known as a foundational stage which includes pre-KG, LKG, UKG, 1st standard and 2nd standard. On that, your education will be based on activities. The next 3 years, is known as a preparatory stage. On that, which includes third standard, fourth standard, and fifth standard. On that, you get an interaction to speaking, reading, writing, arts, science, and mathematics. You'll get to an interaction to those, and you'll have a skills just like the previous classes. And till fifth, you'll be taught in your mother tongue or regional language. The next three years is known as a middle stage, which includes sixth, seventh, and eighth. On those days, you will get an interaction to languages and social science and you will go into depth what you studied in the previous class. At the last, the last stage is known as secondary stage which includes 9, 10, 11 and 12. On those days, you will go to depth into what you studied in the previous classes and you have the choice to select which one to study. 
So you know, only in class has been conducted at these times. So we, the, the policy is also introducing digital literacy for the next generation. So that's all for 2020's national education policy. So at this pandemic situation, you have to obey your parents and teachers because they are a lot hard working for you. So stay home, stay safe and stay healthy. Jai Hind! We wish to express our gratitude to our student Prime Minister for being with us on this event. Your presence and gentle words are a source of encouragement for all of us. Thank you so much. Let us all welcome Dhru from 1C as our beloved Chacha Nehru. Harion teachers and friends, Happy Children's Day. Children's Day is celebrated on 14th November. It is the birthday of Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. Nehru was the first to Prime Minister of India. He loved children very much. He compared children with buds of flowers. Children called him Cha Cha Ji. Happy Bal Divas. Thank you. Next, let us watch a video of Achacha Nehru. 14th of November, our first Prime Minister and a central figure in Indian politics, Jawaharlal Nehru, was born today in Allahabad in British India. He is also known as Pandit Nehru and has his roots with the Kashmiri Pandits. Many Indian children knew him as Chacha Nehru. He emerged as a paramount leader of the Indian independence movement and is considered to be the architect of modern India nation state. He served twice as the president of the Indian National Congress during the independence struggle. He described his childhood as a sheltered and uneventful one. He grew up in an atmosphere of privilege at wealthy homes including a palatial estate and he was home tutored. Nehru was an ardent nationalist in his youth. He went to the Trinity College, Cambridge, and then he moved to London to study law. After returning to India, he enrolled himself in the Allahabad High Court as an advocate, but he did not relish the practice of law. Nehru had his own doubts about the ineffectualness of the Congress, but agreed to work with them. Nehru met Gandhi for the first time in 1916 during the Congress Lucknow session. The two men would go on to form a very special bond that determined the path of the Indian independence movement. By the early 1920s, Nehru had emerged as among the most important leaders of the Congress. Nehru also closely worked with Subhash Chandra Bose in developing good relations with governments of free countries all over the world. However, the two split in the late 1930s. Finally, on August 15, 1947, Nehru, after decades of struggle and years spent in jail, ushered in a free nation. Prime Minister Nehru led India for nearly 17 years, and irrespective of what critics say of his social, economic or foreign policies, it is hard to deny that he laid the foundations of a democratic government and a pluralistic nationalism. From the highest in the land to the humblest, there is abiding affection for him because everyone knows what his lifetime of service and selfless dedication has meant to them. So now let us call our talented performers and start the cultural event. To start with a dance performance, I would like to call upon Ritika of 3C.
performance, Ritika. Thank you. Now, I would like to call Emma and Isha for another song. Nehru Vindi Janmanar Nam Namikyum Nallanar Nam Milulla Thinma Maachi Nanma Nalgum Punyanar Nehru Vindi Janmanar Nam Namikyum Nallanar Nam Milulla Thinma Maachi Nanma Nalgum Punyanar Mere vai kyu ni ni dan, naadi nan ma kapi dan, namma lella me haru tirta, neerin pada tan danam. Mere vai kyu ni ni dan, naadi nan ma kapi dan, namma lella me haru tirta, neerin pada tan danam. Nalla vidya nedanam, nidi bodam kaakanam, nalla varai namu kuchuchum, nanmayal nirakkenam. Nalla vidya nedanam, nidi bodam kaakanam, nalla varai namu kuchuchum, nanmayal nirakkenam. Neharu vindi janmanal. Nam namikyum nallanal, nam milulla thinma maachi, nanma nalgum punyanal. Neharu vindi janmanal, nam namikyum nallanal, nam milulla thinma maachi, nanma nalgum punyanal. That was awesome, Emma and Isha. Thank you. We have come to an end of this event. Before I conclude, I would like to say one famous quote by Chacha Nehru. The children of today will make the India of tomorrow. The way we bring them up will determine the future of the country. <laughs>